In this exercise, we will be projecting objects to multiple section views. In my drawing, I have inserted several blocks of a fire hydrant. Uh, this block is a multi-view block. If I take it into Object Viewer and rotate up into a 3D view, you'll see that I do have a 3D representation of this hydrant. And I'd like to show that in my section views. To do that, I'm going to go to the Home tab of the ribbon. Under the Profile and Section Views panel, I'm going to pull down the Section Views selection and select Project Objects to Multiple Section Views. Now it's going to ask me to select a sample line or a section view. So I'm simply going to pick a section view. And we have our section view group selected along with our projection rules. Now this allows me to pick up things that are not exactly falling on the sample line. And what I'm going to do is set this to a percentage. So I'm going to set this to look back 25% of the way to the previous sample line and 25% of the distance to the next sample line. Uh, you can set this by distance as well. Uh, so you can pick up, just say, everything within 10 feet of a sample line. But we're going to do the 25% distance there. The objects that I can project to a section view are points, solids, blocks, multi-view blocks, 3D polylines, Kogo points, feature lines, and survey figures. The display is dictated by the projection style. There is a fire hydrant projection style already defined in the drawing. You'll see all of the options that can be turned on in the view. And there we're going to show our marker style as a hydrant elevation. That's exactly what I'd like to see. Next, we have to specify the elevation options. Now, I've already draped these particular blocks onto my surface, but I can use the object elevation. I can set the elevation manually or go ahead and pull the elevation from a specific surface. I'm going to use the object elevation and go through, and it's going to project everything. I have 14 items or objects that were projected. Let's go down here and take a look at where this was. This was at station 0 plus 50. So we should be seeing a hydrant at station 0 plus 50. It's not exactly displaying the way I'd like it to. Let's take a look at this. All right, let's look at the projection object properties. The style is set to basic. I want to change that to fire hydrant. And I specified that earlier. I'm, I'm not sure why it picked it up this way. You can see there that our fire hydrant is now showing in our section view. I can go over to another. There we go. And it's showing the same way. So I'm going to have to go in and pick these or change these up for every one of these. But uh, you'll see there exactly how they come in using that projection style. And with this, you can project many different things to your section views and, and show things that you might not normally see or might have to draw in manually.